Good day, folks. It's Tony Fortunato from the Technology Firm. I figured it'd be a neat little session to show you some Windows command line tips and tricks when troubleshooting or investigating Wi-Fi networks. I know that's a mouthful, but it's going to be pretty quick. So the first thing I want to show you is you just go to Command Prompt. You do not need to be an administrator. You don't need any extra software. I'm using Windows 10. It works with Windows 7, XP, 8, 11. It doesn't matter. It works with all of them. So the command we're going to play with today is net sh ylan and basically I'm just going to copy and paste them so I don't make a whole bunch of typos. There you go. So net sh wlan space show space network space mode equals bssid. I'll put the actual commands in the write up so you can just copy and paste them yourself. I hit enter. Whole bunch of stuff comes up on the screen. So the very first thing I want to show people when you do a command line stuff and it scrolls past the screen at the end of the command you can do a pipe and the best way to describe the pipe it's the like the square colons or the long skinny colons usually above the enter key uh, but you'll see it uh, when you find it so it's not a colon it's not a semicolon um, it's this straight bar it's called a pipe and then we're going to type more m-o-r-e enter so when you do that, what happens now is it keeps all the stuff a screen at a time without scrolling away, and you get a more prompt at the end of it. So you can kind of look around and hit the space bar and then move around again, right? So it's just a little easier on the eyeballs. The reason why you do this is because the next step is to find out what you want to report on. So in this case, I'm going to just randomly pick um, the most common things people want to see. So SSID is one of them. Um, BSSID is also kind of important. Why? Because sometimes you have multiple BSSIDs for an SSID and you want to kind of break them out or know what the MAC addresses are and that sort of thing. And the last thing is the signal strength. Now, just uh, obviously this is not an RSSID. There's a whole bunch of articles, people explaining how you can convert that. I'm not getting into it. I'm just going to show you what the raw number is and how that works. So basically we're going to take our old command. I'm just going to, again, just copy this from my other screen and paste it in here. Oops. And that way there's no typos. If I can do this correctly, let's try this again, folks. There you go. Net SH, space WLAN, space show, space networks, space mode equals BSSID, just like we did before, and the pipe. But instead of more, we're adding find string, F-I-N-D-S-T-R, space double quotes, and whatever you want to find within the double quotes. In this case, SSID, BSSID, and signal. And when I hit enter, there it is. So now, instead of watching screens of stuff scroll, because depending on where you work or where you're doing this, you might have dozens, if not hundreds, of SSIDs pop up on your screen. This is a pretty interesting way to limit the amount of output. The next thing you can do, if you'd like, is you can actually put this all in a file. So I can just put a greater than. And I'm going to put, uh, I don't know, test.text, really descriptive, ugly name that I would not suggest anybody use. And then whenever I type test.text, enter, it will open up Notepad, and there's my output right there. So once you get into doing this uh, redirection, if you will, you can append it, you can add the time, you can add the date, you can do whatever you want. It's a really simple, poor man's way of moving around Windows and recording your Wi-Fi statistics. Uh, that's it, folks. So I hope you enjoyed it. It was quick and easy. Have a good day. Bye for now.